guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to today's video and today's home bargains haul. I'm so excited, I feel like I haven't done a sort of home bargains haul type video in such a long time, namely because I haven't actually lived near one in ages. But now that I do, I live like 20 minutes away from a home bargain, so I went there today. So I thought I'd show you what I got. I picked up loads of cleaning products, loads of toiletries, some of the toiletries that I know that I can only get from Home Bargains and guys if you haven't got this specific thing and I'll show you it in a minute you really need it, like just genuinely if you wear mascara and you want to get it off your face this is the thing that you need and I'll share it with you in a second so I'll show you those like cleaning and toiletry bits first that we all love Home Bargains for then over there I've got some like homeware stuff I haven't gone too mad on the homeware stuff although I really wanted to because we're moving and it seems pointless to buy things just to move it to a new house and in the town that I'm moving to there is also a home bargains so I'm definitely going to be revisiting it when like we actually have moved in and like need new stuff for the house so if you want to see some like new homeware hauls trust me there's loads coming up this summer but just for now I don't want to like clutter up the place with like new stuff before we move sort of thing so yeah I have got some homeware bits but they're things to like replace old versions so like yeah I'll show you in a minute and I also grabbed something for my little one as well and they had so many good toys in home bargains it was ridiculous but I'll show you the one that I picked up in just a minute so yeah without further ado let's just crack on oh it's getting hot in here so right let's start off with cleaning products so let's start off with this Lenore fabric softener I don't tend to normally go for like the limited edition like things I just tend to go for like the cheapest one and that's that but when I smelt this it actually smells insane like it's the spring edition um and it genuinely oh smells so beautiful that i could not get it and this massive thing was only like 2.99 which i thought was really good i feel like tesco's own brand is like that kind of price but this is lenore it smells a lot nicer it's a lot more concentrated um so yeah i really just wanted to grab that so i feel like we'll be spending nice and fresh for the next few washes so yeah i grabbed that and then i also grabbed some flash wipes these are also in the spring berry scent i just love a wipe i can't lie i know it's not terribly like environmentally friendly at all but just for when you need to get that like porridge off of the table that like your little one has scraped on these kind of wipes are just really really good so yeah i've just grabbed those i also then got the flash all-purpose floor cleaner in the sicilian citrus scent it does smell really really lemony and i don't think you can beat a lemon scent when it comes to like cleaning the house and stuff we've got a dog and a toddler and like mopping the floor and like making sure that's nice and clean is um yeah pretty much essential so yeah i just grabbed that and that's pretty much my favorite go to like flash floor cleaner is definitely my favorite thing to go for and then i also got my old trusty bleach the 45p bleach that they do in home bargains i mean what am i gonna say about this <laughs> it's just we just all need a bit of bleach in our lives don't we this is like my go-to for obviously like cleaning the bathroom the toilet especially it's just bleach guys just bleach and i feel like you don't need to go fancy with bleach 45p bleach that's all i need i then just grabbed myself some toiletries so the first thing i got was this coconut body wash from home bargains i thought you know what like just a big body wash like that in the shower i actually quite like the color of the bottle and everything on here it's the dead sea collection which i've used in the past um yeah i just really like it and i just thought having a big body wash like that i can use that ash can use that and yeah it's just nice to have a big big bottle just like this i also then got some gradual tan like lotion stuff i'm not a massive lover of fake tan like i do like fake tan i like how it looks but i i'm just not very good at applying it so i tend to opt for things like this which is like a gradual body lotion tan so it comes out like a cream if i just like show it to you it comes out like a cream like that can you see yeah so it's like a cream at the beginning um and then you put it on your skin and then it literally it smells really nice as well it doesn't smell like horrible like fake tan does it's like a lotion and then it goes really gradually like a tan if i put this on this evening which is probably what i'll do then i'll literally wake up tomorrow with a nice glow and it will be like 
a sun-kissed glow it won't be like you're really tanned like you're really dark it will just be like a really sun-kissed glow which is exactly what i like it doesn't like transfer onto sheets or clothes or anything i just really like this stuff again it's always a lot more affordable in home bargains i like this one dove also have one in there but this one was cheaper so i thought i'd give this one a go but yeah that is the kind of thing that i prefer to do rather than fake tanning i do fake tan sometimes but it's just the admin of it and i like always get streaks and it always transfers and it always smells and i just i just don't know if i've got the time whereas after a shower i can just pop this on and then i'm pretty much good to go for the next day so i yeah i prefer this kind of thing i think then for my hair i actually saw that they did these brightening shampoo and conditioners for any of you guys that are blonde like i am i actually got my hair colored a few like last month or the month before i can't even remember now um and i want to keep my hair as blonde as possible especially where the wedding's coming up and everything so i got these two these are the provoke brightening shampoo and conditioner they're like purple shampoo shampoo and conditioner basically for blonde platinum gray or white hair it's called a touch of silver i have used the purple shampoo before i haven't ever used the conditioner but i just thought like maybe once a week i'll use my normal shampoo and conditioner um as i am at the moment but then i can always use these like once a week or something like that or maybe like once every two weeks um so that i can like keep on top of how blonde my hair is uh, and make sure that it's nice and bright for the wedding basically so yeah grab those and they were so affordable in comparison to like other purple shampoos and conditioners these were so affordable especially in home bargains like i keep saying so yeah i grabbed those and then literally the reason i went to home bargains the reason that i've been really excited for this trip is because i really 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 wanted to get myself this this is literally the one thing that I absolutely swear by, like I have used this since since I've been wearing makeup. It's Makeup Remover by Garnier and it's called Simply Essentials Soothing 2-in-1 Makeup Remover for Face, Eyes and Lips. L right, listen, every single micellar water, if that's how you say it, like anything that I use to take my makeup off either takes so, so long to get makeup off, especially like waterproof mascara, or it hurts because you have to rub it or it stings my eyes i don't know whether i am doing it wrong but this is the only thing that doesn't hurt or i have to rub loads it literally comes off so easily so smoothly and i tend to just use it on my eyes i do think that they have discontinued this because I can't find it anywhere else other than Home Bargains and Amazon. On Amazon, it's like £4.60 or something. In Home Bargains, it's one ninety nine. So, and they're the only two places that I can find it. When I didn't, like, I have ordered it off Amazon. It's actually arriving in May because I completely forgot that we had a Home Bargains like 20 minutes away. But one ninety nine. This is one ninety nine in Home Bargains. So I got one, two, three, four of them. <laughs> and this will last me ages. But, like, I'm just, I am serious. This is the only thing that gets waterproof mascara off of my eyes, like, well enough. And I'm being serious about that. Like, if you are going to get anything from Home Bargains, try it. If you struggle like I do. In an ideal world, I would just use water, get my makeup off, and it would be fine. But I just, I don't know about you, it doesn't, it doesn't work for me, like massively well I, I would do it like if i didn't have this that's what i would use i just use like a cleansing pad which i've got loads of with some warm water and it does eventually get the makeup off but it feels like i've got to rub loads um to get that off and i just i just can't i cannot beat this i cannot beat this and i would really highly recommend any of you girls that struggle with makeup removal to get this 100 percent. and the last thing i got in the kind of um like toiletry section was just these two face cloths and they were like 29p i go through face cloths quite a lot like i said i do like my skincare and everything every night and i use it every morning as well so i go through like two of these a day so i just thought i'd pick two up um so that i don't have to do as much washing um but yeah this is pretty much everything that i got in the like toiletries and cleaning category so let's move on to like the more homeware stuff but like i said it's more like stuff that i am replacing rather than like decor pieces so i'll show you what i mean now okay so the first thing that i got was a new set of towels from home bargains so i got two bath sheets like the big ones and then one bath towel and um, the reason that i got like this except this is pretty much what i always get if i get like a new set of bath towels basically for the bathroom i get two sheets one for me one for ash and then i get a bath towel for george it's a decent size i would say like for him at the moment like that's half of it and then obviously yeah 
it opens up it's a really good size it's really really soft like so soft when i was in home bargains i was looking at all the towels and i was thinking i love them and i'll definitely get some when we move but then the lady there was a lady there she didn't work there or anything she was just talking to her friend she was like saying i've got these towels and she was like oh my gosh they're the best towels i ever had they're better than marks and spencers they wash up so so well they're really really soft they keep nice and clean they don't like go like crispy or like anything like that and i was like this woman is selling me these towels and i was like you know what i've got towels that i use at the moment that have got like bleach stains on them and that's not actually like from bleach like this kind of bleach it's not from that it's actually from like i have a face wash that's got benzoyl peroxide in it and if i don't wash it off properly benzoyl peroxide stains so i actually have towels that have that like um pink kind of you know when like bleach gets on color it's like a pink color um so and it's literally like a circle you can see where i've like dried my face and i haven't like washed the face wash off properly um so i want to get rid of those also got rid of that face wash by the way because it wasn't helping um but i think i replaced them with these nice new ones that are apparently better than marks and spencers and they're dirt cheap like i think the towel like the one that i would use for george would was like i think 5.99 and then the like big bath sheets like the really really big ones um were 7.99 i believe and so i got two of those and then i also got the bath towel and then i also thought i would grab this which is a bath mat just to like match them um and yeah i thought that would be really good that lady honestly just completely sold them to me so i was like yep yeah, you've sold me thank you very much i'm gonna get them i did see so many things in like the kitchen kind of storage solution kind of aisles and i loved them so much but i just thought like there's no point in me getting loads of stuff like for storage solutions for this house that might not work in the new house so i didn't get anything but i definitely will be repaying a visit when i move into the new house 100 percent it had loads of like fridge dividers and like drawers and things like that and i thought that was really really good like i, I 100 percent want that in our new fridge but like i said it's just not really any point to do it just yet because it's more stuff that we've got to move but the only thing i did get in the kitchen section were these clips one because i absolutely loved the color of them like in terms of like they're just so pastely and like just so up my street but the reason that i really wanted to get these is because we always have like snacks for george or like even for ourselves and things like and they always end up going off but if you've got these like if you've got like an open bag or something they either go stale or soggy or like whatever if you've got these you can just clip them on and then you don't have that problem and i just think i always my mum always had these and i thought that's such an adult thing but it's right like it's the better thing to do otherwise you're wasting food of it essentially so yeah and these were only like an 89p or something so i've got these i then also got some new bedding because some of ours is so nasty <laughs> like it's just not it's just old like we've had it for like four or five years like and reused it and used it and used it and washed it and washed it and washed it and i just think it's time for some new stuff and it's they're not even like they're not even expensive so i got these two fitted sheets from the home collection i got like a dark gray color really really nice love that it goes with most of our like bedding and stuff and then i also got a light gray one like i said fitted sheets are always for the win for me um and i got the two doubles and they were for 4.99 i believe each um and then i also got a new set of bedding which comes with the pillowcases and the duvet cover and i really like this one so this is what it looks like on the back if you can see i really really liked it because it's like really subtle but it has got like a little pattern on it it's nice light gray and white like it's just really lovely and it was like it will just go with like the greys the whites and even like i can have any fitted sheet with it like that will go with it for example um so yeah i thought i would grab that and this was only like 12 pounds and i thought that was really really good for a set a double set i think the king size one if you've got a king size bed was only like 14 pounds which again is really good so yeah i grabbed that i got one more thing from home bargains which was something for george which i'll show you right at the end but i got a couple of things yesterday from the middle of Lidl and I just wanted to show you because I won't be doing like a separate haul for that because there's only a couple of bits so I just wanted to show you that in this haul so I'll show you those things quickly now so the first thing from the middle of Lidl that I got was this kitchen roll holder the reason that I got this is because firstly I really liked it it was black I really like the black hardware on it we have a like kitchen roll holder at the moment but it's like a upright one and it's like stainless steel and i don't really like it i don't even know where it came from i'm pretty sure i never bought it but this one hooks in to like the um i think it how does it go i think it goes like like that maybe 
So I think it'll go like onto the um, like cabinet like this and then it will hang down. So basically it won't take up any like worktop space, which is like nice anyway, but in our new house, our kitchen is gonna be a lot smaller. Um, in the meantime, like we're planning to renovate and knock walls down and make it bigger. But in the meantime, having less like kitchen workspace is not not a good thing so we are going to use this which will free up some space on the worktop plus i just prefer it anyway and then we'll just get rid of our old one so like i said i'm just like re anything i've bought today i'm like replacing i'm not like adding to the clutter i'm like replacing it um and then when i was like getting that i also found this which was for wine glasses so again the same sort of like um like black metal like hardware which i really liked it would like slot on to a like cabinet there and then you've got these um i don't know what they are called like the little racks i guess that you just pop the wine like glasses in you put like the end of the wine glasses in and then technically so they'll be hanging down upside down and then you have space underneath to like put more glasses so again another like storage solution type thing so i got that from the middle of Lidl as well i then also grabbed these hangers for um trousers so i have like probably I don't have loads of trousers but I've got like some work trousers and stuff that I want to hang up and they're so like I, it takes up so much space because I have to like put one pair of trousers on each like hanger if that makes sense whereas these ones you can put three pairs of trousers on each hanger um, and I've got two hangers so there's like six pairs of trousers there and it won't take up as much space because it's a lot thinner and these match our hangers that we've got for like the other things as well but obviously especially for trousers so I grabbed that from the middle of Lidl as well. The last thing that I got is the thing that I was so excited about when I saw it because let me tell you I do not like ironing. I, I really really despise it and I don't think I'm on my own with that and I saw that this little bad boy was on offer and it is a silver crest steamer handheld steamer and i'm very very excited to give this a go because i've got lots of like um for spring and summer i've got lots of like blouses and like things that crease basically and the thing is i just tend to not wear them because i can't be bothered to iron them however with this hopefully hopefully i will like update you um but hopefully this works and like does a treat with like all of the clothes that i don't wear at the moment because they're creased and i'm not gonna iron them but hopefully with the steamer i can get the creases out and wear the clothes that i like um and fingers crossed it's all good and the thing that drew my attention to it was it was only 12.99 so i thought you know what I cannot go wrong with this. I'm gonna give it a go and fingers crossed it works for me. Annoyingly, I went into Lidl yesterday and then obviously went into Home Bargains today and I went into Home Bargains and there was a Swan steamer, like a handheld steamer, pretty much the only same but a Swan version um, and it was 19.99 and I think if I had had the option to like have those two things next to each other and, and make the decision, I probably would have gone for the Swan one because I don't know, just again, like it just seems like a better brand i don't know whether that's actually true or not it just in my head it was that but yeah anyway i've got this one now so i am gonna stick with this one but if you are looking for a handheld steamer and you wanted to go for the swan one it's only 19.99 in home bargains at the moment but in the middle of Lidl, they've got a 12.99 bad boy so yeah i'm gonna give that a go and then last but not least the last thing that i got in home bargains was for george my little boy who is 18 months old 19 months old sorry oh my gosh i was so impressed when i went into home bargains when i went to like the kids section the like toy section the, even the, like the toddler toys they've got loads for babies loads for toddlers and then loads for kids and i don't think i've ever really gone into home bargains like for George like I've always either gone in for like cleaning products or toiletries I never really thought about looking in the kids section but oh my gosh I was so impressed they honestly had so much but the thing that I picked up was this little Peppa Pig toy that I think he's absolutely gonna love you guys know how much George loves Peppa Pig it's ridiculous the only thing is it doesn't have a little George in it which I think it's kind of disappointing but other than that i'm very excited for him so basically it's called the drive and the steer car and it is a car which george absolutely loves like pushing around anyway but it's got a little steering wheel and if you put the batteries in and everything you can steer the car so it's a remote control car um and it says suitable from 18 months plus which is perfect for george it's pepper pig which he loves he's loving cars at the moment everything he's car 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 everything all the time and um, so i just really 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 could not leave this and i couldn't not show it to you so so yeah this was like 22 pounds i think which you know 
not exactly the cheapest but equally it is a really cool thing so I really hope you enjoy playing with this but yeah I grabbed that but like I said they had loads of Peppa Pig stuff in there they honestly had like a whole aisle full of Peppa Pig stuff so if your kid is like mine and absolutely loves Peppa Pig then definitely go and check it out but yeah that is everything that I picked up from Home Bargains and a small section from the middle of Lidl I really hope you enjoyed this video guys thank you so much for watching let me know if you want to see any black particular hauls or anything down in the comment section down below if you want to go clothing if you want to go like baby clothing if you want to go more cleaning products if you want to go more like homeware stuff whatever you kind of fancy let me know in the comments down below and i'm trying to do more hauls and that kind of stuff on my channel now so yeah anyway i hope you really enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching i will see you very soon in the next one bye guys